Euro NCAP is releasing the first test results of a fully electric car, the Mitsubishi Aimeev, which marks the start of a series of electric vehicle tests planned throughout 2011. As testing electric vehicles is new to Euro NCAP, additional preparations and precautions are taken while testing the cars in the laboratories to ensure safety before, during and after testing for all persons involved. The battery in this case is located below the area where the occupants are sitting. This is the most safe area because it doesn't deform during an impact. The electric vehicles will have a so-called safety plug or a maintenance plug. In this case, that safety plug will automatically disconnect the battery uh, during impact at the same time as the airbags will be deploying. So here's the indicator light which will tell us uh, whether the automatic disconnect function of the battery has actually worked during the crash test. During the test, for instance, we have the fire department ready to help us if there is anything happening. After the test, we have somebody with protective clothing on who will uh, measure if there is any voltage on the vehicle itself. Electric vehicles should meet the same safety standards as other conventional vehicles. Euro NCAP tests plug-in vehicles with live batteries at laboratories with specially trained personnel. But the cars are exposed to the same testing conditions as other cars in the programme. The vehicles undergo the full-scale tests, including frontal, side, pedestrian, pole and ESC tests. However, during preparation, 